In today's video, I'm going to show you how to render 4K images in UFN without using an actual 4K screen. You will ask me, but Hogni, how is that possible? We don't have a console in UFN. And the answer for this is simple. We have a special camera blueprint. A guy on Twitter named XZSendence made a special camera that allows you to take screenshots in any, almost, resolution possible. You can't make screenshots in any screen ratio except 16 by 9. A solution for that can be simple. You can just take a huge screenshot and cut it later. As you can see, we don't have this camera in UEFN and that's because we need to install it first. You need to go to Xsendence Tweet and here scroll down and you will see this link. You just download the file and go to your downloads folder. Here you will have the file. You need to rename the file so it doesn't have any spaces and the problem is that I already downloaded one and Windows added one with a space and UEFN doesn't support names with spaces. So we need to make sure that we don't have any spaces in the file name. Now when you open this folder you need to go to your content drawer and here in your island content uh, right click any object and select show in explorer. Here. Uh, it will open your island folder and now you need to drag this file from here to your content folder and that's it now you'll get a window in UFN that's uh, that's an unknown asset it can break your island and stuff like that but it will not because it's just a camera and also I forgot to mention that you will need to remove the camera from the content drawer and your scene as well to publish the island and launch the session because Fortnite will not allow that. Now enjoy the rest of the video. So yes, allow these assets. Now you should get a, ha a camera here. Um, I think I need to restart UEFN. A few moments later. So now we got the blueprint here. We just take it from the content drawer and drag it onto our scene. Uh, we can rotate it a bit and position as we want it to be. It doesn't really matter. You just choose the best angle for your render. And here you can even pin this. So when you select other objects, the camera preview is still here. Uh, now let's go through all the settings here. It works almost like a normal camera in UEFN, but here you can select the resolution and I prefer to leave it on just normal full HD, but increase the multiplier right here. When you increase it to two, then you'll have a 4K screenshot. And if you increase it to four, you will have an 8K screenshot. So yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> uh, to take a screenshot, you just need to tick this box and that's it. Another thing I need to mention is the file name. It doesn't save it uh, with a new file name each time. So if you want to take five screenshots, you will need to rename the file right here every single time you take a screenshot. So that's not a good thing, but we can deal with it. So I chose 4K, uh, 4K screenshot tutorial, for example. Um, now let's tick this box to capture. Uh, it lagged a little bit and here we got a notification that high resolution screenshot saved as. We can select this file here and here we have the screenshot. 4K screenshot tutorial. Let's go to properties and here you can see the dimensions 4K. So that was nice. We have a nice 4k screenshot so that's it for today uh, that's how you take 4k screenshots how you make 4k renders in uefn uh, that was a quick small tutorial and in the next video i'll show you how to use mask textures so join my discord to get a notification subscribe to my channel like the video and see you in the next tutorial